We had our first rain out since August 22nd with the Lions and Eagles finale not being played. Yesterday, we saw both the Tigers and the Bears score 11 runs on their way to victories on the road. The LG Twins were the only home team to win, and they barely did so via walk-off fashion in the bottom of the 11th inning after being down 4-1 to one in the 6th inning. The only team to win their miniseries outright was the Kiwoom Heroes who swept the Lotte Giants and outscored them 19-10 to 10 in the two games they played. For player news, Wyvern's pitcher Ricardo Pinto gave up six earned runs over five and a third innings and took the loss Friday as the Wyverns fell to the Tigers. He allowed five hits, including three home runs, and posted a 4-2 to two strikeout to walk ratio. Kia Tigers outfielder Preston Tucker went one for five with a home run and three RBIs in Friday's victory over the Wyverns. Twins pitcher Tyler Wilson gave up five runs on four hits, one walk, and a hit by pitch through six innings in Friday's 6-5 victory over the KT Wiz. He struck out six. Here are today's odds courtesy of FanDuel Sportsbook. It's a brand new mini-series of KBO matchups with some great pitchers taking the ball tonight. Dan Straley, Drew Erzinski, and David Buchanan will all tow the rubber, while the KT Wiz will have William Cuevas going for them, meaning a foreign starter will go in four of the five games tonight. Today's Daily Fantasy must-start is Addison Russell. Russell has three hits over his last two games and just reached a career high in KBO RBIs in Game 1 versus Lotte. Despite David Buchanan starting against Kiwoom, I still like Russell because I think this Kiwoom Heroes team will continue to score runs as they've done so recently. They've scored 24 runs over their last three games, and Russell is due for another big game. Make sure he's in your lineup tonight. For game previews, we're first looking at that Lions Heroes matchup. David Buchanan is facing off against Hun Hee Han, and both starters proved they can be either boom or bust. Hun Hee Han was on a great stretch of three starts, allowing two runs per game, but has since allowed nine runs in his last nine and two-thirds innings pitched. Buchanan has impressed in his last three starts, but all three took place against either the Wyverns or the Eagles, two horrible teams. The last time he faced the Kiwoom Heroes, though, four starts ago, right before he faced either the Wyverns or Eagles, he got lit up for eight runs on nine hits while he gave up six walks and not even five innings pitched. Odds are that at least one of these starters get blown up big time, so the over looks like a lock right here. Next, the last place Eagles team takes on Lotte Giants pitcher Dan Straley. Both teams are 5-5 five and five in their last 10 games, and in terms of recent success, you might actually give the edge to the Eagles here since the Giants just got swept by the Heroes. But when you remember that Dan Straley is returning to his ace form as he th tossed a shutout in six strong innings against the Lions his last time out, you got to go all Giants here. That also means the Eagles won't score much runs while the Giants average just five runs a game, which is seventh worst in the KBO. Over the Giants' last three games, they've been averaging closer to four runs a game. So I really like the under here, and that seems like the solid bet.